A Waco Film Festival is pushing on through the COVID-19 pandemic by taking the show online. Fox 44's Cameron Stewart talked to one of the festival's founders today, and he joins us live in the studio. Cameron, the show must go on, right? Sure does, Adam, and this is the fourth annual Deep in the Heart Film Festival. They sh used to hold it in March, but moved it to August this year, not knowing how the year would turn out. With their new format, though, they found some unexpected advantages. It's not just about the, the film part of the film festival, it's about the festival part of the film festival. And so we're really trying to do everything we can to recreate that. The fourth annual Deep in the Heart Film Festival was supposed to be in August. With mass gatherings put on hold around the world, it will instead be a completely digital event premiering this weekend. We've always wanted to actually have an online distribution part where you could go to a website, watch the films for a certain time that you didn't get to catch during the festival. So it's kind of a way to say, OK, we're going to try that anyway. Even in future years, we're going to try that. Let's see how it works now. With over 120 short films and music videos to show in the festival, the digital aspect allows movie buffs to watch all the films available, something they wouldn't be able to do in person. Not only the filmmakers themselves will be able to have their films seen across, you know, a, a wide range of time, but also for the film festival goers to be able to access that. Uh, we actually, if you purchase a block, you start watching that block, you actually get 24 hours to watch it, so it's on demand in that situation. The virtual format will allow for more people to watch Q&As with the filmmakers and makes the festival more available on a global stage. Uh, I'm looking forward to the fact that we have more reach than we normally have, so I'm excited that we, we have some uh, blocks that are geo-blocked to Texas. It's a duplicate of our normal block that's going to be worldwide. Uh, but for the most part, everything's going to be available across the world. Being online could actually help the festival grow. Yeah, we're really hoping that our reach increases and that it really lets people know who we are in the festival circuit, lets people know that, you know, we're here, we're for quality, uh, we're for here for the filmmakers, we're here for our community. And Coming up at 9.30, hear why these filmmakers wanted to bring the festival to Waco. In the studio, I'm Cameron Stewart, Fox 44 News.